For this body weight, every minute on the minute sequence, you're gonna perform three different squat variations. First one, you're gonna have your feet out wide. It's gonna be sumo squats. Whenever I'm doing a body weight squat, I like to bring my arms up for a little counterbalance. So it's gonna be one, two, sitting deep into that squat. Feet are a little bit wider than my normal squat stance. Toes are pointed out a little bit further, so usually around 45 degrees, and then I sit back so that I try and get as best as I can close to parallel sitting back in my hips, but my lower back stays straight. You're gonna go five sumo squats, then you bring your feet in. You're gonna go five regular squats, one, two, three, all the way to five, and then you finish off with five narrow stance squats. You can have your feet uh, either shoulder width apart or you can bring them right together. What this exercise is going to do is you're really going to load up your quads, but given that your feet are so close together, you're going to have limited range of motion. So you don't have to go all the way down. I'll show you from the side. It's going to be down. One, two, three. And I'm feeling that tension placed right through my quads. Big toe is still pushed down into the floor, so I got my VMO going. It's going to be sumo squats, regular squats narrow squats, and then you rest for whatever time you have left in that minute, and then you repeat the sequence every minute on the minute, the amount of rounds prescribed.